What's up everybody, Provis here with another episode of Magic Duels Origins, and we are going to get into it today. I am preparing my body for the pre-release of Battle for Zendikar, which I am going to be attending tonight. Uh, it's, uh, just in case you guys didn't know, Friday. So I will be going to the midnight pre-release. And uh, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> it's going to be my first actual pre-release. I mean, I've done tournaments before, but I've never done a real pre-release. So uh, I'm hoping for a more casual uh, experience. It's going to be pretty late. It's going to be midnight. So I'm going to hope that uh, everybody's uh, particularly friendly. I'm not really sure what I should be bringing. Do I have to bring my own lands? Is the store going to give me lands? I don't know. Whatever. Why are we talking about that when we've got important things to do? We've got a Kithian. We've got a, we've got everybody. We've got everybody. Uh, is Kithian a turn one drop here? I don't even know what my opponent is doing, so I'm going to go with no. Uh, I am not comfortable dropping Kithian down right now. Uh, much later, when I can actually pay for that indestructible. Uh, and I still don't know what my opponent is doing. And now it doesn't even matter. Now I can get a white, because I think I got more double white than double black. So I gave him information, which doesn't really seem like it's going to matter, because he's, yeah, he's not going to be popping that Evolving Wilds until... Much later, I will be dropping my Child of Night for show. He's going to be popping his Evolving Wilds. I'm guessing Heliod's Pilgrim will get me Nimbus Wings. Definitely. Never mind. I don't know why I even had to think about that. There is construction going out uh, outside. Very steamy street work. Steamy street work. That sounds almost sexual. I don't mean it to be sexual. I'm just saying that there's like a steam engine out there. <laughs> there's a fucking galvanic juggernaut crushing cars outside. No, it's not the case. They're, uh, they're doing some street work, so if you guys hear it, I apologize for that. I do. I know it's bad. Um, okay, this kind of changes things. Uh, I want to swing in. How aggressive do I want to be? If I attack, he's absolutely 100% blocking. So I guess I just won't attack. I guess I'm just going to Heliod's Pilgrim. I could Reef Soul that 1-1, one, one, which just seems like such a waste. I, I, I don't feel like I can do that. Instead, what I'm going to do is next turn, if nothing significant changes, it's going to be Nim Nimbus Wings and Kithian. Should I do them both? Eh, maybe. I will Nimbus Wings. I may or may not Kithian. Actually, I will, because... No, I, I can't afford the indestructibility yet. Can't do it. Alright, well, I'm definitely doing that. I want to see what he does. Uh, I guess I have to worry about Reclamation Sages. Disperse is definitely a possible poo-poo. Uh, poo-poo for me. Getting rid of two, two of my cards. Unfun. Glad he used it there. So he's got... Uh, what, what, what would you say this is? Simic Control of some kind? Interesting. I like it. He's definitely got a lot of card draw. Oh, this might be a, uh... Well, I mean, I can't drop my Child of Night anyway. I can drop Kithian. If he's got Simic, he probably doesn't have direct damage. I will drop this. Okay. I will drop it. Not sure how I feel about that. Um... I don't know. I, I just I'm not I'm not sure how I feel. I don't like putting down Kithian, uh, but he's not playing black. He's not playing red. That, at least that I see. Oh, he is playing black. Okay, so this is not Simic. All right, so he could actually reef soul now. Okay, he couldn't. He didn't. Good. I'll just go ahead and grab a uh, swamp with this right now. I'm a little scared. Gotta be honest. I'm not. I'm not. That that one one is holding me back a little more than I thought. Uh, I will have five lands next turn, so I could drop the Child of Night and uh, and keep um, Kithian's Indestructibility open, which is probably what I'm going to do. Let's see, he's got four lands, and I've got four lands. I'm going to get five lands, though, aren't I? So I will double attack. He will probably block the Kithian to, to hold up to hold up my uh, my lands. Uh, keep a black open for Child of Night. There we go. That is right. Indestructible. 
And Child of Night now. Actually, you know what? As I'm playing this, if he swamps Languish, I'm going to start crying. I... I mean... That is now a possibility. I mean, I, I'm totally thrown off because I saw Simic Caller, so I, I was sure that he was just playing Simic, but he is actually playing Black in there. So he's definitely doing some kind of a control deck. I haven't seen enough cards to really guess what it is. That seems premature to me. He does get another card. He can put it down because he didn't play one yet. So let's see. That'll get him a Reef Soul open if he wants it. Nope, he wants to drop that, which is totally fine by me. I will absolutely Reef Soul his uh, Nissa, who I think honestly was a very premature drop. He should have put down that. Uh, he should have put down that Elvish Visionary first, I think. And let's go, baby. Let's go. Uh, how many lands do he have? One, two, three. Jesus Christ. One. Let me count this. One, two, three, four, five lands. Okay. So... No, fuck that. I'm swinging all in. Who am I kidding? boop de boop And now I can flip Kithian. That's fine by me. Kithian flippy dips. Flippy dips. What's it? What's his plus one? Next turn, target creature gains indestructible and untap it. That's not the most useful thing. Uh, gonna be just plus two in him then. And I'm gonna be dropping a Knight of the White Orchid. Okay, fine. I know. I said I was gonna drop Knight of the White Orchid before. Obviously, I haven't. <laughs> but uh, fuck it. You know, he, he's been doing. He's been doing good for me. He's not always optimal, especially when I play first. He's really weird. Man, this guy has been getting all his damn uh, Elvis Visionaries. And, I mean, he's digging for shit? I have no idea what he's getting. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and guess that this is the Mill Pile. Or, even if it's not, he at least has Mill, mill Enchantment in here. Uh, what is it? Sphinx's Tutelage? But, I'm, I'm also gonna just go ahead and guess that he hasn't grabbed it yet. I don't know. I don't know. Well, obviously, I swing in here. Obviously, right? Obviously. Totes of. Totes of. Gonna go ahead and grab Knight of the White Orchid. I wonder if I should have uh, turned Kithian into an, an angry creature. 4-4 uh, four, four creature. What, what, what are you playing? Oh, I see. Yeah, that, that's fine. You wanna just grab some cards? I totally hear you there, pal. Attacks me next turn if you're able. Or I give one of my bruhs indestructible it's. Prevent all damage that would be dealt to him this turn. I have no idea what to do. I'm just gonna go ahead and make this guy swing into attack and die. <clears throat> That's my plan. That's my plan. I'm gonna kill you one one. No more chump lockers for you, Magic Man. Oh my. Yep, that's that's what I wanted to happen. Uh, do you think he's got a wild size or something? I don't know. Let's find out. Looks like a no. Okay. He's got all this card. He's got a lot of cards in hand. Oh darn. Well. Sucks there, but at least I still got the 4-4. And he's got a little Alchemist file. I got the 4-4 out of uh, Gideon. So that's good. Magic Man. I got a lot of control of my own in hand. So I'm not feeling too bad, honestly. I think, uh, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Suppression Bond and Reef Soul, so I guess Reef Soul on the little things, Suppression Bonds on the big things. I just don't feel particularly threatened right now. Uh, I mean, he, he's got it. There it is. I knew that was coming. I, I figured something like this was going to happen. I figured. I figured. Well, there's three cards for him. 
Oh no, is it two cards? And oh, okay, he just doesn't have to discard. Okay. I mean, you're real late for that party, though. You're way late. I could destroy the activated ability of this, but I don't really want to. <laughs> I don't feel the need. I can just come on in here, start beating face. Oh, no! Oh, no, Alchemist File to stop him from attacking. Very cute. There goes your, uh, whatever the Metalcraft crap is. Okay, so can't do anything there. I will drop this. Do I want to Suppression Bond that? I don't know. I've got 37 cards left. He's on 8. I'll, I will reserve the right to Suppression Bonds later. I don't think I want to. Like, he has to eat up his entire turn just for that one, uh, one thing there. So, it doesn't seem... It doesn't seem worth it to Suppression Bonds that tutelage because it, because that passive ability on the top, that's still happening no matter what. There he's got a creature that needs to die. What's he bringing back? Can't be Languish, that's not that useful. Uh, I don't know what he brings back here. Nissa. Okay, Nissa I can take care of right now. Nissa I can take care of. Um, do I take care of them both? Yes. Yes, I do. Yes. Oh, no, I can't take... Um, he played a creature. Yeah, I mean, he played a land. Sorry. That, he fucked up then, didn't he? Ooh. Okay. I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll do that. Suppression bond. No, I don't want to do that. I, I want to re-salt. Damn it. Now he knows what I have. That kind of sucks for me. Um, I'm still going to... Yeah, I'm still going to do this. I don't care. I don't care. Swing it in. He's got to block it. He's in. He's on a two-turn clock. Uh, yeah, alright, good. I'm. I, he knows I have a suppression bonds now, which sucks. But does it change anything? Does it? I don't know. I, I, I want to say probably not. 28 cards, down to 26, there we go. Another one of these fuckers, I don't know, grab another Nissa, I guess. Just... He knows I have the Suppression Bonds, but this time it won't actually matter. Okay, and I don't think he played a land this turn either, so he might actually be able to, uh, to flip her. But he's still got a way to go here. I don't know. Do you think he's gonna use uh, drop out that uh, four four for her? See, he can draw a card, which probably is what he ends up wanting to do. Or he could dump. I think it's a two two, or it's a it is a four four. Now he does the four four. All right, that makes sense. He knows I got the suppression bond, so that that's fair. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and suppression bond Nissa. So, she no longer makes him draw cards. I get a 3-3 three, three out of that deal. A 3-3 three, three flyer, by the way. <laughs> and I'm just going to keep swinging. Yeah, I'm just going to keep swinging. He's got to block it. He's probably going to uh, chump with a 3-2. I think that would make the most sense. His Nissa is now bricked. Oh, that's, that's a shame. Man. What a shame. Okay, I mean, if he's got all the cards to, uh, to wait me out, I'm in trouble then, aren't I? I definitely don't care if he swings in. I prefer it if he does, honestly. Bounce my Gideon. Oh, bounce her. Good idea. You can play her again. Draw another card. Well, alright, he, he's getting close here. He is, he is fucking slowing me down hardcore. He could do this. I mean, frankly, he's also milling the shit out of himself, but he could do this. This is possible. Uh, Alright, he chose to draw. Oh, I guess it's not actually a draw. This is a draw. What's that card? Reveal the top card. Oh, and just put it in your hand. I see. So it's not actually a draw. I thought it was a draw card. It's not actually a draw card. Wow, man. This guy's doing serious work to me right now. If he's got three, uh, he, he could, he could very much have another uh, fog in hand, which would not be my favorite day. Uh, 
Uh, I guess I gotta do this pre-combat so I have a little more. If he doesn't have the fog, which I'm almost convinced he does. Uh, suppression bonds, confirm. He can't counter this. It's right there. That's how it rolls, baby. And do this again. I guess I could start killing his creatures, but I don't feel like that's... If I make them attack, like, who cares? I, I mean, I gotta, I get to blow them up. I don't care if he do, deals damage to me. I want to deal damage to him. So he, I want him to use up his fogs. I want him to use up his creatures, his chump blockers. Looks like he doesn't have a fog. That's great. I got achievement. I have no idea what that achievement is. I will take a look at it after this game. He's real close, man. He's got to take care of that. That he's got to take care of a few things right now. His Nis is bricked. He got a lot closer than I thought he was. I'll tell you that, man. <laughs> For a mill pile. Holy crap. I mean, I know I'm not running the most successful uh, deck right now myself, but I even so. Ooh, is that game? Oh, he just needs to draw two. Does he have me? Reef soul on the four four. Reef soul on the one two. Okay. And inspiration. That's game. Son of a bitch. How come he wasted my time? Wow. I can't believe he got it. Close. Why did he waste my time with those reef souls? Honestly, that's kind of that kind of pisses me off. Whatever. He got it. Oh, and he's still wasting my time. Okay, come on, man. You win. Stop. Stop fucking around. Seriously. Jesus Christ. What versus battle? Yeah, that's right. Let's get back in there. Let's see if we can get a rematch with that asshole. Who uh, is trying to play a mill deck and just barely made it, made it through. Did not get that rematch. We are after Magma Man. <laughs> I don't know what the name of these Planeswalkers are. I know some of them. That's not true. I know the Fab Five. I know the, the big ones. You know, Gideon, Liliana, stupid ass Jace that Wizards is so desperate for us to love, which I just don't give a shit about Jace. I am a Kraken. <laughs> That's great, man. Ooh, that's not. Okay. I can handle this. This looks great. Uh, he's on the play, which actually is great because I have a, a Knight of the White Orchid. So, fucking great for me. Uh, he is playing red, which is not so great for me. But I do have <laughs> three Reef Souls in hand. So, if he is doing the uh, Red Deck Wins or, or any kind of a... Ra oh, maybe even Rakdos Rush. Uh, I'm probably okay. Still no plays. Wow. All right. Okay. Uh, gonna drop the Child of Night here. And if he doesn't play another creature that I want to Reeve Soul... I mean, if he even plays a 1-1, one, one, I guess I would want to Reeve Soul. I, maybe Dragon Fodder I wouldn't Reeve Soul. Oh, obviously I wouldn't Reeve Soul Dragon Fodder. Uh, Reeve Soul, my Child of Night. That is fine. I'd rather the Child of Night than the Knight of the White Orchid. Who is coming down right now to ramp my ass up. Boots. I said boots with the fur. The whole club looking at her. Now I'm Ed. Uh, well, actually, I have a hand entirely filled with uh, removal. And if he's got that uh, control, that all right, that's fine. <laughs> that's good. Infectious bloodlust. No, does that get it out of uh, reef soul ability? Is that plus two or plus one? Plus two, no! Oh well. Uh, yeah, I'm not blocking that. I guess I will uh, suppression bond. So actually, he loses a... Uh, he loses an infectious bloodlust with that, which is nice. But he's ahead in damage. Why did I hit that button twice? I don't really like wasting a suppression bond here, but... It's, what, it's what's got to be done. He is playing some kind of a Rakdos Rush deck. Um, not how I would build it. I think uh, just plain red deck would be a, a better move. But, eh, that, that's how he likes it. Oh, no! Well, actually, this guy I can hit with uh, Reef Soul. So, we're clearing board here. And I think I'd still be ahead just for the sake... Oh, he can't play that yet. He can't play it yet, so it's still Reef Soul time. But we do know that he has it. Man, these lands. 
Uh, he's down to three cards. I've got my three cards. One of his cards is a Reeve Soul. All of my cards are removal. And, well, I guess he could play a creature and then Infectious Bloodlust it, which could suck. Oh, Jesus. This is exactly what I don't like to see. <laughs> this is the same kind of crap that, uh, that I see every time. I mean, I bitch at people for playing enchantment decks. And this is the reason why. Like, when you don't have a creature, you're fucking done. <sighs> and you know he's got removal. Do I play him? I feel like that's the worst idea ever. Well, as long as he only has damage removal, then I guess I'm alright. You know what? I can still put Nimbus Wings on him. Do I want to? I don't... I mean, there's something fundamentally wrong about doing this on the turn that it comes out, but... You know what? It was wrong, because I should have Reef Soul... Well, Reef Soul isn't, a, isn't an instant, so fuck it, never mind. I was gonna say I should leave Reef Soul Mana open, but I couldn't anyway. Uh, so I can turn Little Gideon... Kithian, I guess? Kith... Kithkin? Kithion. Kithion. Indestructible. So I guess that's why he's not wasting his, uh, his removal on it. I am just landing and removaling. <laughs> Let's see what he does here. <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh, if he does have that sack effect where he gets, like, Blood Flow Connoisseur or Nantuko Husk, and he then active treasons my Kithian, even if I give it Indestructible, he'll still be able to kill it because he'll have control of it and he can and sacrifice gets around indestructible. A lot of things actually get around indestructible. Sacrifice, uh, going into negative power, and just straight up exiling. That uh, and and then of course just things like suppression bonds and and, and you know like uh, claustrophobia and shit. That sort of crap also gets around it. Uh, so I mean I guess I'm facing a red deck. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. That's exactly what I'm talking about. So let's just do this anyway, just in case he doesn't have the removal for it, but I think it's incredibly likely that he does. So we are now tied, 12-12. Um, not, not having high hopes for, for Kithion surviving this round. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. Uh, I do at least have the Reef Soul, and he cannot infect with Bloodlust. Remember, that is still in his hand. He won't be able to infect with Bloodlust, that, uh, that little fuck ticker. Oh, wow, I can't believe how many lands I've been getting. You know, guys, uh, a little a little trick you may have known about magic. Um, you won't win if you keep drawing lands. I, I don't, you know, a lot of new players think they will. Uh, that's not true. That, that's not true. If you have no plays for 32 turns in a row, you tend to lose games. It just you know, just another, just another notch of tips. You know, just a little, just a little uh, in in my in my tip book for you. Just a little flips tip. You know, just just to help you out a bit. Wow, there we go. That's nice. Hopefully, he puts on a creature that I can su suppression bond. Uh, if it's a Liliana, I will not actually suppression bond it. I will let that. Well, I guess I would still reef soul Liliana just because he gets a two two out of that deal. If it's a Chandra. If it's a Chandra, I'd let that flip, and then I'd Suppression Bond. Um, okay. I mean, at least it's something. You know he's got nothing but removal in hand, because he's not playing shit. He's, he's got a hand... He's, I don't know what's in there, but he packed it up full of fucking removal. Yeah, I, I know he does. I know that's what he has. It's, it's obvious. But what choice do I have? I, I really can't do much else. Maybe I should have waited. Ooh, that'll be good. Okay, this is what I want. And go grab Nimbus Wings. And then I can get a 4-4 out of this deal. Do this right now. Okay. Yup. Thank God. And this is when I cast, so at least I have it. Alrighty. Of course, he does have language too, doesn't he? Son of a bitch. Do you think he languishes here, or do you think he waits for me to... uh? to make another another 4-4 angel. He would, he'd probably languish here, right? Because he's at 12. He's going to be taking half his life next turn if he doesn't. 
Traitor's Instinct on the 4-4. I'm assuming I'm getting hit with 6. And then maybe, I don't know, Bone Splinters? Oh boy, what do you think? You think he runs Bone Splinters? I bet he does. I am actually going to block here. I know this seems crazy, but I'm going to do it because I'm almost convinced he has Bone Splitters. Yup! Fucking knew it! <laughs> I fucking knew it! What'd I tell you guys? What did I even say? <laughs> oh, it feels great to be right, man. It feels so good to be right. And I'm just top decking creature modes. Maybe I should hold off on these guys. I want him to go through his damn... I want him to put down a fucking permanent that I'm afraid of. Like, how, is, how does he win? You know, like... He's got all the removal. How do you win? This is not how you build a Rakdos deck, dude. This is... Thank God, man. He's got ten lands and four cards and zero plays. It's... Oh, of course, I'm just getting all the fucking complete bullshit here. I knew he had that, uh, Bone Splinters. That block was scary, man, because if he didn't have it... I don't know. Then then I would have just, uh... Thrown away my creature. But then I would have gotten my 4-4 my back. So he had some way to sack it out. Infectious Bloodlust. Alright. Thank God. And hit me for 5. That's... No, no, hit me for much more than that. Six, seven, eight. That's a lot. That is a lot. Suppression bond incoming. You more? Holy shit! That's eleven. Holy crap! I thought he just had nothing but removal. That's much worse than removal. Okay, he had a bunch of these things. All right. Uh, let's hope uh, he doesn't have uh, 10,000 uh, Twin Bolts. He doesn't need 10,000. He needs three Twin Bolts. But he only has one. And I need more lands, guys. I don't know about you. But holy shit, do I need more lands. <laughs> I need many, many more lands. Let's, let's go into combat. And let's hit him for half his life. And let's just drop this fucking Evolving Wilds right now and pop it immediately to try to thin our deck out because god damn Damn it, I need another land. Real bad. Real bad. Holy shit. Look at all these lands in my... In, you know they're all one after another. In my... In my te deck. Mmm. 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 Okay. And he's gone. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. Well. <laughs> Guess he didn't like that. That lifelink uh, kind of ruined his day, I assume. Um, can I kill him? I can. He's dead. He's dead. Thank God. Jesus Christ. What a fucking game, man. <laughs> Bad deck, by the way. I'm sorry. I am a Kraken. Uh, I love your name. It's incredible. But your deck... Uh... No. No, man. I saw almost half of it. Literally. Almost half of it. And it, it can be better. Uh, I almost want to make my own Rakdos. I have a Rakdos, but I don't want to. I don't want to play it right now. I want. I want to play the Aura deck. I want to play it. I want uh, Kothafed. He's going to be showing up. He's going to be helping me out with it later. That's what I want to play. I don't know. I just. That's just how I feel. Uh, yeah. Sorry about the lack of content again. Um, I, honestly, I've been doing a lot of uh, drafting on MTGO, and I find MTGO just ugly. <laughs> I'm saying that. I'm saying. I'm being polite. But it's hideous. <laughs> it got hit with an ugly tree. Now scratch that. An ugly forest. A goddamn ugly forest planet. Alright? It got hit with Endor. That, that's what MTGO is. So I want to... I, I don't know. I like drafting a lot. I think that's my favorite, uh, favorite way to play. Drafting uh, sealed, less so. But uh, my second favorite would be sealed. So, in order, I don't know, drafting sealed and then uh, constructed, maybe, I don't know, constructed standard, I guess. I don't know, don't really care after that. Uh, and MTGO is just a great way to play it. So, I fucking love playing it. And that's what I've been doing mostly this week. Mostly getting into, um, you know, how to how to actually draft as, as good as possible, <laughs> or as well as possible. Uh, so I can be prepared for the uh, for tonight, actually, for for the pre-release. Which, by the way, you guys, one more time, 
if uh, go head down to your local hobby store today you know like uh, less than 30 bucks or 30 bucks will get you in to yeah one creature this is a horrible keep this is a horrible keep and you should not do it and I'm going to do it and what am I thinking oh my god why did I do this Whatever. Uh, go head down to your local uh, hobby store and, for God's sakes, who plays that? A and get into get in get in get in the pre-release, man. Thirty bucks and you'll get a uh, you'll get six boosters and and a spin down and a few other stupid little things and one foil uh, rare mythic thing. I could play him. I'm not gonna take the hit on tempo anymore. I'm 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 fucking sick of it. I really fucking hate it. I really 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 do. That 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 this is the main reason I want to get rid of this damn card because the fucking tempo hit. Like I can waste my turn and not put him down, but that seems like the worst idea ever. <laughs> For God's sakes, why would I do that? Oh, it's awful. And he didn't even. Put, I mean, it wouldn't just be this next turn. It would be for like two turns. Not worth it, man. Uh, this is amazing. Absolutely play Liliana. Holy shit, yes. Wow, what a fucking great draw. Uh, I will... Let's see, if I attack, he'll probably just block. I and mean, he'll probably just take it, right? Do I give a shit? Not really, because I still have a 2-3 to block his, uh, either one of his creatures. I assume he just lets this through because he doesn't want to flip my Liliana because that would be stupid. But on the same time, he can't swing with his shit, uh, at least yet. I'm hoping this isn't mono white because that would be silly. Um, you really want to splash other colors, man. It's just, it's just the way we go. Oh, boy. Sorry, guys. Got a little sleepy there. And I really shouldn't be getting sleepy because I got to be up at midnight to play fucking sealed for like I don't even know how many hours like two or three hours uh Nimbus wings on my Liliana <laughs> doesn't that sound like a horrible idea <laughs> that sounds awful what a stupid plan oh Nimbus wings on you okay 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 I hear ya let's see how does this guy work not Nimbus wings this guy Oh my god, and now I can't even move it. I'm hitting the sticks, so they're not moving. Whenever this guy attacks, if it has Renown, they get plus one, plus one. Okay. So if I Suppression Bond that guy... Oh my god, do I really want to Nimbus Wings everybody? Because that sounds like a stupid idea. <laughs> that sounds stupid, right? That's just dumb. Uh... Uh... I'm not gonna do that. I'm I'm going to Nimbus Wings this dude. And I'll just leave it at that. I will just leave it at that. And then I'll hold back a bit. Oh, that'll stop him from swinging. And I already don't really like this guy's deck. Uh, I don't think, I mean, if you're just playing a monocolor, it's pretty la lame. Just a day. I mean, and here I, I mean, I know I play mono red, but that's really the only color that's worth. But I, my, the mono red that I play is a little more Elliot. It's got 16 lands for God's sake. So come on, you gotta, you gotta give it some, some fucking feels. Okay. You swing all in. Do it. All right. Flip my Lily. Wonder why he's doing that. Okay. I mean, I'm all, I'm all, I'm happy with that. Uh, yep. I'm okay with this. I also hate Divine Favor. I think that's a really, really bad card. <laughs> it's just really quite bad. I will be hanging on to that swamp, I think, for discard fuel. Do you mind if I do? Ooh. Uh, I do want to suppression bond to this immediately, though. That's that's kind of a thing I gotta do. And don't mind 
if I do that either. And don't mind if I do that. All these things I don't mind. And I can't swing because then I'll lose my Liliana. Can't do it. Can't do it. Do it. <coughs> wow. Uh, oh, that sucks. Just lost my Liliana. All right. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, no. Oh, right. Enchantment. That's a creature. So, well, I still lost my Liliana, actually. No matter what. So here I am shitting on uh, Mono White, and it just kicked my ass. Well, that sucks. I did have a questionable keep. Could be my fault. Wait, did I have a questionable keep? Yeah, I did. I did. Because I only had one creature, and now here I am. Because I like I kept a one creature hand in a deck that desperately needs creatures. So why aren't you just swinging all in, man? Dude, swing all in at Liliana. That's <laughs> then then she dies. <laughs> you know. Then you can keep your last card. That's 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 how this works. Yeah. Yes, obviously. I don't know what you were thinking about, bro. Um, I will be blocking the 3-2, I guess. Let's see, can I afford everything else? If I get a land, I can afford both of these. Otherwise, I feel like that's just kind of a waste. So, I'm just, I'm just gonna throw it out and then deal with the 8 damage. The 8 damage! I'm on a 2 turn clock. Two turn clock. Yeah, I mean, I'd be on a two turn clock either way. Oh, darn. Darn, if only you were relevant. Which you are not. Not even a little bit. Uh, I absolutely 100% lost this game. That totally sucks for me. Uh, I, I have... I mean, I guess a Reeve Soul would be okay. Um... I mean, I'm taking this. I don't have much choice. A Reef Soul, I guess, can get me out of this. Uh, consec another Consecration Bonds, or not Consecration, whatever. Suppression Bonds might get me out of this. Any kind of removal, I guess. Wouldn't be too bad. That's not removal. But I will be able to at least play both of these. matters at all. Not that this matters. This can stop... Whoop, whoop, whoop. This will at least be able to stop uh, that guy. Not that that matters. Unless he's got another pump spell of some kind. So, I don't know. This this is still kind of a mess. No, I'm not swinging. Oh, are you, is that a joke? <laughs> this is still quite the mess. White. Maybe I should have put it on this guy. Then had a little more lifelink. But if I put it on this guy... Actually, yeah, I definitely should have put it on this guy, right? Because then he would have had... 3 plus an extra 2. So 5, he wouldn't have been able to get killed. Fuck! Fuck! Misplay. Cost me the game. Well, no, I probably lost the game anyway. Uh, that's a joke. Oh, that's game. That's game. If I have removal next turn, I can survive maybe another turn. But this is probably over. Which sucks. Super sucks. Makes me sad. God, what a bunch of slow ass games. No fun. No fun as hell. At least, you know what? At least they're not all doing rush decks. I mean, even the Rakdos deck wasn't really a rush deck. So, eh. Why, bitch? Why, bitch? Why? Yeah, they're they're both out of even uh, of even. What the hell was I gonna say? Reef soul range. I can't even reef soul them. There's nothing I can do. Nothing. Let's see what I get. That is a land. So, I lost. Uh, GG... Pilly Pad, whatever your name was. And... That sucks. Super. A lot, actually. That makes me feel kind of bad. I wish, uh... 
I mean, I I did make misplays, but uh, I mean, thinking about the misplays, they they would whoop 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 whoop. I I didn't mean to play that. I meant to walk away. Uh, thinking about the misplays, they they would not have they would not have changed anything. I, I would have lost regardless. So makes me sad. Uh, I guess you're gonna get one more in here. Uh, I did not mean to, but I I, I wanted to look at my deck actually and sort of sign off on it. That is so much better. Actually, you know what? You're right. The, the misplays that I made were definitely those hand keeps. Those were very bad. Definitely should have mulled. Uh, this is way, way better. I actually have plays now. A little low on the creatures. God damn it. And if this is Golgari control, it's gonna suck. That helps, uh, except they do get to keep an enchantment, which I will bet you anything is going to be Evolutionary Leap. Yeah, of course. Of course. I know what you're playing, man. You're not you're not fooling nobody. Darn. Darn. Nin, 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 nin. Get creeper vine. Come on, you really got to think about this. Just grab it, dude. Come on, man. I don't want to. I don't want this fucking episode to go up to 50 minutes. Jesus, they go so long. I want to do like 30 minute episodes, but I just can't help it. I love fucking playing. <laughs> I just keep playing. I keep making plays. Uh, Reeve Soul on the lady here. Lady in black. That's stupid. Well, I mean, no, it's not stupid. Okay, this makes me feel... Yeah. This makes me feel like this isn't, uh, because, um... I don't think Golgari Control actually plays that, do, do they? Do they play Nessus Pilgrimage? I have no idea. I don't think they do. That's more of a ramp camp. They usually drop, like, tons of creatures and card draw. But, hey, whatever. That's how we're gonna play, that's how we're gonna play. Uh, got, got several suppression bonds. I am very low on land, unfortunately. This is, I'm, I'm really waiting. I mean, I have my domain, which is awesome. That has reach, which is super not awesome. <laughs> so, I'm actually fucked now. I really need a reef soul. Or, and the land, the land is not, not the best land. But uh, it'll it'll do, pig. That'll do. Uh, that does have reach, so I'm not having what a, what a fucking draw. So am I playing elves then? I really thought this was Golgar control. I guess I'm playing elves. In which case, um, tragic arrogance is going to be amazing. <laughs> it's going to be fucking great. Never mind. Uh, that is not an elf, so you do not get a free elf out of that. You do not get a free elf. Uh, well, actually, Tragic Arrogance will not be amazing, because I am nowhere near uh, where I need to be for uh, for lands. I will be able to drop this 4-3, uh, which is nice. Ooh, I'm going to go for the white. Going to go for the white. And hopefully get a land. Yeah, that's the wrong land, but that's okay. It's okay. At least I have Suppression Bonds open. That's the good news. That is the good news. And hopefully next... I'm just going to do this now. He knows what I'm playing. I don't give a shit anymore. There's not a whole... I mean, the benefit of doing this on his turn... Significantly lower now. <laughs> Alright, he knows what I'm playing. Uh, once I get tragic... Uh, tragic Arrogance will be online in one turn. Or in one land turn. When, whenever the next land is. Which I hope... Really hoping. Because, I mean, I draw a ton of lands all the time. So let's... Honestly, let's... I mean, I got a bunch of lifelinks. So that's why he's not swinging. Um, that's not a land. But Suppression Bonds is open. But do I want to hang on to it? He's not swinging in anyway. He definitely doesn't run Languish. Not in a deck like this. So I'm going to drop another one of these. I'm not too worried about Mass Removal. Green doesn't have any any Mass Removal. And the black Mass Removal, he wouldn't play. I'm not swinging in with a 4-3. Uh, because I need creatures. <laughs> I really want those creatures. Uh, I guess now that I have them together, I could, but now he's just going to be shitting out a ton of these guys. So I'm probably less likely to do that. That's going to be uh, a bit of a bite. That's going to hurt a little. Oh, no, it didn't. I didn't realize how few elves he actually has. That's incredible. I'm blown away at how few elves. Ooh, there it is. Okay, over over tragic arrogance, we are going, we are going hardcore here. We're going to start suppression bonding. We are going to start really fucking this guy up. So what shall we do? How aggressive do I want to get? 
I've got all the control I need. Can he wipe it? Uh, the reach goes here. 4-4 four, four here, and then the 4-3 here, and that'll trade. And that'll trade as well. And what's his backswing? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. But I've gained plenty more. Yep, alright, I'm swinging. Because they all got lifelink. Hell yes. Okay. Time to get aggressive. Reach goes there, that's the obvious block. Make that trade and make that trade. Okay. That is all right. I'm gonna keep that tragic arrogance nice and open. If he does shit out all those other elves that actually scare me, like I'm actually surprised he did the full trade. That I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't give a shit about. It. I have a 30 life. Who gives a fuck? Nothing really matters. <sighs> Suppression bonds on that guy, and then my 4-4 flyer will be able to come in with impunity. <laughs> He absolutely 100% runs Reclamation Sage, right? Not Reclamation, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna do it, you guys. That's so greedy! So greedy! Oh my god! Oh my god! A little bit of a tempo hit. A little bit. Actually, not too much, right? Because the other option would have just been Suppression Bonds. And who cares about that? I'd have just Suppression Bonded the 3-4, uh, and then I'd sort of be in the same position. It doesn't really make a difference. It's not like the 4-4 the four, four was gonna... Oh, god damn you guys. You guys, why are you doing this to me? Alright, I'm swinging. I'm swinging. He wants to block. I'm happy to fucking let him have it. Have it. He's not gonna even have it. He, it's a 3-4. What am I thinking? He doesn't have shit. God, these tempo hits I'm taking are real bad, but I'm setting up so good. I'm giving in to the temptation. I'm probably playing real badly right now. <laughs> I'm giving in to the temptation for those big swingies. But uh, my tempo, my tempo, my god, my tempo. It's so bad. Oh no, there's my blight call caller. Uh, if he wants to. Is that a tap ability actually? I'm not even, I'm not even sure, is it? Oh my god, that's annoying. It is, so alright, I, I, I got a while before that's relevant. I got a while. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna block that. <laughs> it's fine. Discard an elf, and it'll, so it'll give me neg three, neg three. That will absolutely kill my blight caller. Meaning, suppression bond goes on this dude. And the neg two. Oh, wait, yeah, I could, I could have just totally killed him, huh? Alright, well, fuck it. <laughs> How dumb. How dumb. Whatever. Suppression bond's gotta go on somebody. The next one's gonna go on the 3-4 because the 3-4... I didn't want to do it on the 3-4 because uh, it was already tapped and I was like, eh. Why waste, it, why waste it then when I can do it on him when he's untapped and thinks he's gonna block one of my 4-4 four, four flyers when he's suddenly not gonna block one of my 4-4 four, four flyers. You gotta make the trade. I would absolutely make the trade. 0-2 for the 2-3. Save yourself 2 life. I mean, what else are you gonna use these guys for? You don't have an evolutionary leap in hand. I mean, uh, unless you're waiting for it and you're just gonna sack him to that. I don't know. I don't know what he, how he runs his elf deck, but I I think off the top of my head, the way I run my elf deck, I would have I would have uh, saved myself for the two damage. Killing the who? The two three? Okay, okay, fair enough. Now see, he doesn't realize that he's dead because I am going to suppression bonds. Wow, what a, what a fucking what a fucking deal. That is game. Not, not as slow as I thought it was. Oh, yeah, he didn't like it. Okay. Fair enough. I mean, I will only leave games if the guy you're playing against is just fucking around. I don't think I'm fucking around. Well, I may have. Ah, never mind. I take it back. Transformer. Thanks for the game, man. Um, didn't see uh, enough of your deck. Don't know if it was really good. Maybe you just got shitty draws. All right, for reals now, I gotta go, you guys. Uh, love yous, and uh, if you saw me make a misplay, just let me know. If you wanna make a game with me, let me know. You don't have to put it in the comments. You can just PM me. Uh, I don't think I've ever actually, uh, I have received a PM before, but uh, I'm not, not sure on a timestamp of when I would get back to you. Definitely over the weekend, I think, although we are going camping this weekend, so I might not uh, 
I don't usually, re I'm not usually on the computer this weekend, uh, on any weekend, honestly. That's why there's never, don't expect content on the weekend unless it's a really, really lazy week. But uh, ordinarily, yeah, I'd be, I try to release, I don't know, an episode every every other day or so. Uh, on, on busy days, it'll be five days a week, but that's usually, like after Zendikar releases, I'm probably going to do uh, five days a week for the next couple of weeks. But then it'll it'll just sort of slink back into every other day. Anyway, don't mean to ramble. Love you guys. Have fun out there. Pre-release happening tonight. Let's go.